your personal assistant right at your keyboard doing whatever you type. And it's better than real humans, honestly. It's called Rube. You can find it down there in the description, and this is what it does. So, hey Rube, extract action items from last Monday's team meeting in Notion and create Outlook tasks with deadlines. So, right out of the bat, you can see that Rube can interact with other apps. It can interact with ChatGPT, with your email, with Slack, with Perplexity. Notion, Google Sheets, Drive, whatever, and it's a breeze, honestly. You know what I do? I constantly switch tabs. I constantly switch windows, whatever I'm trying to do today, and that's exhausting. This, on the other hand, well, you've got all your apps working together. It's just like your assistant is giving orders to all of these apps to perform better, to work for you. So it is over at rube.app, and as I've told you, there's gonna be a link down there and it has more than 500 apps that can be interconnected. If you just click on the marketplace right here, you're gonna find all of the apps that it works with. So for example, right out of the bat, you can see that there's Gmail, GitHub, Notion, Twitter, Slack. People are using it for a lot of use cases. People are also using it for social media research. But in a nutshell, what it does, it allows you to work from one place, not many places. It is one command center. You control all your digital tools, whatever you use in your workflow through AI, and it's just using your natural language. You just type it in plain English. On the left here, you can see that there's a lot of these categories. I use a lot of f f finance because I work with some stocks and some crypto as well on the side as a side hustle, for example. You can see that it works with coin ranking. This is what I use and it can always give you updates. For example, I connect it to my Google Sheets so I can get an update of this week's performance. And there's a lot of these things right here. CRM, project management, file management. It can interact with Figma designs. It can send all of it over to Slack. Basically, whatever you tell it to do. It can go through your emails. For example, you can just give it an order to go through your emails in the last let's just say 48 hours, and it can summarize the important ones and mark promotional emails as spam. You know, it just saves a lot of time. I think it saves me one hour per day by just not switching windows and going over to all of these different apps that we use now. And you know how it is. You are overwhelmed with all of these apps that we need. Well, not anymore. And the best part, you can integrate this with ChatGPT. That's what I use. They've got custom GPT here. As you can see, this is Rube. And whenever you're first using it, first of all, it's gonna be setting up time. First of all, you have to give it permissions. If this is your first time using it, you're gonna have to give it permissions so it can connect to your email, to your Slack, to your GPT here. And I know that a lot of people are sometimes concerned with it, but if you scroll down on the webpage and you see this, so how secure is my data with Composio? As you can see, it is compliant with all of these standards and it inherits, Rube inherits all of Composio's security guarantees. I trusted myself and honestly never had any issues with it. Also, as you can see, can you do something that we discussed this morning? So it follows you and it remembers what you did this morning, yesterday, an hour ago. It is really, really that good. Now, as I've told you, every time you set this up and every time you use it later on, you can con you have to confirm because Rube wants to talk to this custom chat G custom GPT, and then it's gonna talk to the connector. And every time you're gonna have to do that, I think there's gonna be some kind of an update with this. But as you can see, it connects with 500 plus apps and 15,000 tools. Also, there's Twitter, Instagram, TikTok. It can do a lot of work for you there. You can summarize yesterday's Slack activity after time off. And essentially, it's just like talking to ChatGPT. You just tell it, what do you wanna do? And then it'll find the tool that it can be connected to. It'll connect your apps one time only, as I've told you, whenever you're just first setting it up, you have to give permissions, and then you will run the workflow live. You don't have to install anything at all. It's all cloud-based. And here are some examples here, but this is, you know, these are simple, like summarize my last 50 emails. But what I commonly use is that I wanna get updates from stock market to my stock portfolio, which I have in Google Sheets. So I tell it to 
get an update, put everything in that Google Sheet that is to update the Google Sheet and then send all of that to my email and my Slack because I have friends that I want to share that with. The more tasks and the more complicated workflow you've got in your day to day, well, it's gonna be more powerful. Now, as I've told you, the setup is really, really easy. You just go and click on install Rube here and then you choose the platform. For example, you can connect it right away to ChatGPT or you can connect it to your WhatsApp. It all can be done with one simple click. Just click on this button here, chat with Rube, then just give some permissions, open the link with your WhatsApp on your desktop, for example, and immediately it, this is gonna open up in your chat window and it's gonna give you the link to just connect your account first. And of course, just give the permission, allow the access. And as you can see now, we've got Rube here. You can chat with it. Of course, you can use it on your mobile mobile device. So how can you help me, Rube? Just send this message and then you will have the WhatsApp connected to it. The same goes with all the other ones. Now, when it comes to the pricing here, you can see if you head over, first of all, you can start for free and you can have all the access to basic apps and Rube Chat is gonna have 1,000 per day requests for free. So this is perfect for personal use as it says right here. But if you wanna get full access to more than 600 apps, unlimited Rube Chat and priority support, whenever you have any problems with it, it's gonna be $25 per month. But if you take the annual version, you're actually gonna save 20% off. So it's gonna be $20 per month build yearly and this is how it looks like inside of it so this is the browser version of it this is the dashboard from here you can just type whatever you want just like these examples here and of course on the plus icon you can add images pdf files whatever you want to work with also you can drop rube into your agents as well you can use it to help you in your N8N workflows. There's a lot of use cases, honestly. So I invite you to click the link down there, try it out for yourself, and just see and witness the power of it. The link is gonna be down there. I wish you good luck, and I'll catch you in the next one.